Hello, this is Volkan from Turkish Republic Antalya with the Overwatch Investigator. How to fix unexpected kernel mod trap? Alternative method Windows 10 update error. I am reshooting this video. Um, I will try to explain you the basics. I will also put the links in the descri description like this. Um, I have tried to update my computer for the last six months. Um, maybe over 50 times, but I maybe over 45 times. I never watched them updated. I just seen uh, when everything finished. I've just seen that uh, update didn't succeed. And then last night I watched all the process and I've seen the problem of, of where it's stuck. Uh, I will try to tell you what happened in here. Unexpected kernel mod trap error code. Uh, I don't think this will help. There's a, it is a link in the description. Navy insert software. This will be automatically solved because we will restart it uh, in the safe mode after we finished installing in the normal mode. Finished installing the update in the normal mode. We will restart at the time. Uh, in the safe mode I've done this but it didn't help uh, I think this helped uh, as FC scan now this helped um, I also write this stuff in the description and another thing also helped when you go to system uh, you can do it like this this PC properties advanced system settings advanced uh, it was already open settings and choose small memory dump I also choose none it didn't work uh, just choose the small memory dump as this videos explain uh, do that do the SFC uh, command run SFC you can write CMD command prompt run as administrator SFC slash scan now it will search system files Verific make a verification on system files and fix if the, he, it found any problems I think it helped but the thing uh, where it really helped is you just download Windows Update Assistant from Windows Windows Microsoft site uh, download the Update Assistant uh, and delete the update assistant from your computer even you download the updates uh, and immediately start the inf installation and uh, download and after that installation installation also with pre-installation I can say you also finish now what you are going to do when you are waiting for 25 minutes just go to here also write ms config this is what I do or Go to the system configuration app and on the boot choose safe boot uh, and say OK to the Windows Update Assistant. Say OK to restart. Don't wait 25 minutes, just say OK to apply to restart. It will give you another one or two minutes before restart and do this safe boot and apply and OK. Say OK and close and double check it for example if you did it and it didn't happen say apply ok you will have t time to do this five times maybe yes it is here say ok and exit then uh, 
do the restart like that it will the first restart, restart will be safe boot the windows will finish update will finish but when uh, the last restart to show you the new windows uh, the safe boot sign will be removed in here you will find it like this yes you have chosen to run with the safe boot but it will fix this the new update will fix it and you will find here like this safe boot will be closed and it will be normal start or selective startup uh, this is what can I tell you for now if you have any questions please uh, write me down below I will all I always check my site um, and please uh, like uh, press the like button for other people uh, to find this information I haven't find this information in anywhere on internet just do these uh, things in exact order and exact uh, type I can say uh, so please help others to also find this solution uh, thank you for watching stay well